And Justin's going with the Storm team. Storm Wester and Akuma. Justin, of course, ran with the She-Hulk team at EVO and lost that. Maybe he's been playing this for a while. Right. Oh! oh. Justin just can rock the finger right off the bat. That's pretty much what that is, yeah. Not a ton of damage out of it. No respect. Justin following up Kumo. Oh, he got to the other side, but was blown up by Tron. You have to respect that Tron assist. You can almost never rush down when she's ready. Right. Hey, you really got to keep your mind uh, aware of when Tron is ready and when not in making your approach. He's mixed up. X Factor just like that. Yeah, PR Rogers is so good for that mid screen mix up with Dante. And here comes the DHC. And not enough to kill. He doesn't have any more meter. Oh, but Lolo. That's it. Backed up again. No more X Factor here, but he's going to have two bars. Oh, no. Not going to use it. Oh, X Factor. Wow. X -Factor that was so throw. smart. That was brilliant. Amazing. Classic Justin Wong fashion. Wow. Demon. Oh, oh that, was, that was just, you know, frames before. Yeah, Rob. Really frames before. Hammer right there. But it doesn't oh, matter. Man. Justin still on the verge of a huge comeback. What's going to happen here? And no more level 3 X Factor Akuma. And that means his road is much harder. I think this match is in Akuma's favor, but with PR Rog, you never know. Your right. taunt is very dangerous. One air throw is all it takes. Nice, picked her up. Justin's controlling the pace of this matchup. Yeah, he's been very strong so far. He can't get hit even once, though. PR Rog can afford to mess up two more times. Let's mention PR Rog has five bars. We've seen this drill before as well. That's right. Justin with the tattoo. He's just been running away. I think Justin's Keeping on trying and whittling away the life. I think Justin's definitely one of the hardest people to hit with a grab super. Yeah, now Justin is in the lead. He has played excellent keep away. Just jumps Justin back with the Wong, super. Is that Justin, enough? Yes. Justin Wong with another comeback added to his his collection. Yeah, and, and he has a lot of faith in level 3 X-Factor Akuma, but there you can see Akuma, even without X-Factor, still a serious threat. Just ask for Richard Nguyen. This time, pretty different start here. Kyorog already in. Making things happen. Kyorog looking to kill Storm right off the bat. He comes to the DC glitch. And she is dead. Working on a perfect over there, but let's oh, go. Good block great. Like block. Oh, wow. So many mix ups at once. There was the mix up one time on the side, then it was the other side, then it was the other side there's, again. There's only so much blocking you can do. If he, he blocked all that, I would accuse him of having a block mark. <laughs> yeah. And it still looks like it's probably going to be game here. He's got three bars. Into another. Oh, oh he missed oh. it. Okay, yeah, he has to be yeah. safe there. He doesn't want to give Justin any kind of a chance. What's going to happen? Oh, Justin uh, went for it. Tron is what's going to happen. And we're going to be in... Oh, no, no. are we? What? We're not going to be in game three yet. This should Tron be dead. might Tron. be dead. She's dead. Justin's getting all that life back. At the end of this next match, Kuma could have 25% life. That's not bad. Oh, and he's Justin done with Dante. Wong. Don't give him a chance. Justin Wong. This man and his comebacks. Got another chance here. And sets it up again. Oh, no, just outside of the L. Justin Wong. Just chasing him around. Never count out Justin Wong. Not going to be dead yet. One more. He can chip him. He can chip him. Oh, and Justin Wong comes all the way home. Two amazing, beautiful comebacks by Justin Wong added to his collection. Justin Wong eliminates Puerto Rican Balrog.